The next song on my playlist is Honey by Eric Badu. This video is amazing. Um, I thought this was like an old, old school um, video when, and record actually when I heard it and saw it. Um, and it's like, it's her walking through a shop for like three and a half minutes. Um, record shop and picking out loads of albums and every single one is an amazing front cover and it's kind of embarrassing it puts everyone else's to shame um it's just a wicked video i've never seen anything like it and apparently it was her idea so i was asking around whose idea that was because i thought it was amazing and it was her idea so again a bit of personality going into your own videos which is always good so that's why she's one of the best artists i've ever seen live as well so here it is honey by erica badu Next one on my playlist is Weapon of Choice by Fatboy Slim. I'm a huge Crystal Hawkins fan and a huge Fatboy Slim fan. Very proud of Fatboy Slim, he's British. He's doing really great. Well, he did great, it's kind of stopped with me. This video was the first video that had like a celebrity in it that I remember, um, and it's hilarious. And I never knew that Crystal Hawkins was a dancer before he was an actor until that video came out. And it would be amazing to like turn up at a hotel and to see Crystal Walken flying and <laughs> doing a dance routine in the lobby, it would be great. So here it is, Weapon of Choice by Fatboy Slim featuring Crystal Walken. So the next song on my playlist is My Moon, My Man by Feist. This is on my list because I adore her, I think she's great. And I loved her second record, I think it's her second, Gatekeeper as well. Um, and no one in the UK really knew who she was with that album, um, but my French flatmate gave it to me and I, I fell in love with her. And then she came back with this recent record, which I just think is incredible, The Reminder. And this video, her videos are always so innovative and they're always so like special and like fun and personal and thoughtful. Like I think so many videos don't, not really much kind of passion and kind of, you know, personality gets into them, but her videos are always so good. Um, and this one's where she's on a conveyor belt in an airport and she just kind of, people are just walking along it and you think it's just going to be quite a crap video, but it ends up being amazing and they start doing a dance routine on the conveyor belts. So here it is, one of my favourites by Feist, My Moon, My Man. Next video on my playlist is Learn to Fly by the Foo Fighters. Well, it's not there really, is it? It's just Foo. Foo's. I'm a huge Dave Grohl fan anyway, um, and just looking at him normally just cracks me up. Um, but I love how he plays those different roles and the rest of the band in general. And um, I have a real bad fear of flying and this video made it all right to a certain degree. So here it is, this is Learn to Fly by the wonderful Foo Fighters. So the next song on my playlist is Calm Down Dearest by Jamie T. I am the biggest Jamie T fan. He put out my first single, um, Limit Edition, in the UK, Hometown Glory. And he took me on tour for a couple of shows in the UK and he's just fantastic. And I think he's gonna be like the next Elvis Costello, so watch out, he's great. Um, and he's really great live as well. So here it is, Calm Down Dearest by my favourite, Jamie T. Next video on my playlist is Cry Me River by Justin Timberlake. He's my favourite, I dream about him often, um, and he's great, and he's, he's a real showman. If I ever got the opportunity to meet Justin Timberlake, I probably wouldn't say anything. I'd probably just stand there like a dork. Ha! <laughs> so here it is, this is Cry Me River by the beautiful Justin Timberlake. The next video on my playlist is Thriller by Michael Jackson. This is on my playlist because it's a bit cliche, not cliche, is that the wrong word? I don't know, everyone always picks this video as the best video, but it is the best video, so that's why. And the album's the best album ever as well, so. Like everyone else, I'm gonna follow the crowd and pick Thriller by Michael Jackson as my best video. I've got about, literally got about 100 cousins, so we used to do the dance with team in the playground. <laughs> yeah. So here it is, Thriller by Michael Jackson. The next video on my playlist is Here We Go Again by OK Go. I heard they were about to get dropped by their label and when they made their video they did it on their own and they ended up doing this huge comeback and like, it's like the most viewed video ever or something. Um, but yeah, this was part of our music lesson at school. They showed us this video um, and like how they kind of turned their careers around and used the internet and took it all into their own hands. And their videos just made me laugh. And yeah, they're great. So here it is, Here It Goes Again by OK Go. The first video on my playlist is Losing My Religion by R.E.M. I picked this song because it was the first video I ever remember seeing um, and my mum was a huge, or still is, a huge R.E.M. fan. So they were always in the house. Well, not them, literally, but, you know, the music. <laughs> um, yeah, and this was the first film um, video I remember seeing and I think it was possibly the first time I ever watched MTV. So that's why this is my first video. So here it is, Losing My Religion by R.E.M. The final video on my playlist has to be one of my own and it's going to be Tracing Pavements. 
I chose this song as my own video because I only have two. <laughs> I had the most fun making this video. I did it in LA. Um, we were going to do it in the UK, but the dollar was weak or something, and we got to do a video for half price, so it came all the way out. And it was um, the worst flight ever, but the best day ever. Um, this was before anything had happened in the UK, let alone here or in Europe. And I felt like a true movie star. And it's opened a lot of doors for me, this song, so my baby. The flight was really bad. Um, I've never been on a flight that long. I've only like, occasionally flown to Spain, New York, go on holiday. Um, and it was the worst turbulence of all time. Like, literally for half an hour, the plane was just kind of going like that. And we were like, having to stop ourselves. And there was this like six-year-old little boy just laughing at me. <laughs> and I was screaming and crying. Um, so I drank about 12 miniature bottles of wine and then woke up in London. So we survived. There's always bottles rolling around. <laughs> it was good, but yeah. Got home safe, so yeah. All right. So here it is, Chasing Pavements by me. Hey! <laughs>